Well, hey there, good people. I wanted to talk to you for just a brief moment. As we are seven days, eight days away from Valentine's Day, I know that a lot of people struggle with love and relationship. I wanted to remind you that the most important relationship to have is one with you, one with yourself. Most people forget to embrace that relationship with themselves, enhance their relationship with themselves, love on yourself naturally. Because when you go into relationships externally outside of yourself, you're looking for someone to fill a gap that it is not their responsibility to fill. You have to begin working on your own self-love. Oftentimes people come to me and talk to me about their relationships. And one of my questions is, why are you self-sabotaging? Why are you getting to a point where you begin to fight relationships? And most often they don't have an answer. The truth is, when we begin to look at the relationship with yourself, we can identify why you're having relationship problems externally. If your relationship with yourself is not intact, it doesn't matter how much someone tries to love on you, be there for you, and support you. One way or the other, it'll boil down to moments of self-sabotage. Self-sabotage can look like being angry out of the blue, getting upset over small things that really don't matter, but you're using as an anchor to cause discourse because you're not happy with yourself. Self-sabotage can look like pushing away uh, affection from people after you've decided that you don't want to feel and that you're numb or that you're afraid to feel. Those moments can actually block you from a healthy relationship because you haven't given yourself permission to love you. Another area of concern becomes validation. When you don't validate your own worth, other people are only going to treat you the way they see you treat yourself. If you are verbally abusive to yourself, emotionally neglectful, to yourself. How can you be open when somebody wants to naturally love you? It can be fearful. It can be scary. Give yourself the gift of self-love by Valentine's Day so that you can embrace whatever love comes your way, right? Hold on to being loving to you, honoring you validating you and respecting you. And then you'll attract the right kind of love your way because you've opened yourself up to loving you. Stay true to you. Be good to you. Love on you always. That's your first priority.